Hey guys, I'm back here with another set review. It's the Lego Monster Fighters and it's set 9464, the Vampire Hearse, 314 pieces. And uh, it averages around $40 from, depending on where you get it from. Uh, this is the front of the box. And uh, let's show you the back of the box. Okay, so let's get to the actual minifigures and everything of this set. Sorry about that. Okay, first is Dr. Rodney Rathbone. Now, he's really cool. I do like his sword. And uh, he's got a gun and a sword. And I do like his robotic leg, and it kind of reminds, I don't know about you guys, but um, it kind of reminds me of the Harry Potter set with uh, uh, Al, uh, Professor Moody in it. I don't know, that, that's just me. But um, And this is what his uh, body looks like from the front. And there's the back of his body. And uh, he's only got one face, unfortunately, but still a pretty cool figure. And then we got Lord Vampire. He's really cool, minifig. Uh, fortunately, in this set, he does not come with his cape. But I still think this is a great set, even if he doesn't come with his cape. Um, I really do like it because his face glows in the dark. The, he does come with a sword. A darkish gray sword. And uh, here's the back of him. And uh, he does come with a second face. Um, and here's the zombie driver. Uh, really cool figure. I really like the detail that they put into the outfit. Um, and then they got the brown hand and the kind of deadish hand. Uh, and there's the back of it. Here is Rodney Rathbone's motorcycle. Pretty cool motorcycle. Comes with some dynamite and uh, these flames show how when it moves. It, uh, comes with a light right there, make it look like a light. The handlebars, and I really like the detail that they put into this motorcycle. Though they could have done a little more with it, I think. I mean, it doesn't stay up very well. I mean, when you saw the Catwoman set, it had a better, it stabled a lot better than this set. Uh, but I'm not really complaining all that much. The, it's a pretty cool set. Um, and now for the hearse, my favorite part, and I'm, of course a lot of people's favorite part. The, here's the front of it. Um, there's the moonstone right here. With the bat on it. You just place it right in front there. It's got these two fangs here. Make it look like a vamp since it's a vampire first. And uh, this does pop off. So you can put people in it. And, uh, seats too. I really like these bones that they put on here too. It's really nice detailed. And, uh, they got these that move up and down. And, uh, this and then the window right here. 
and uh, this is the back where um, and it's got two other fangs. Uh, and right here is open space, and uh, it's got the coffin in here. Here's the other side, another window. And uh, another cool thing is this feature. Just move that, and that pops up. You just push that down. And I do recommend you do it a couple times because it's really tough at first. You're going to want to practice that a bit because it kept on popping all my Legos off and everything. Uh, so you're going to want to test that a couple times to make sure that it does it right and everything. So that comes off easily. This pops open easily. So, um... Yeah, and then here's the ins. Let's uh, there's the uh, coffin inside. It does come out, and uh, opens up. So yeah. Uh, all in all, this is a really great set. I recommend you get it. It is one of my favorite sets. Um, oh, and another thing. This does glow in the dark all, as well as his face. So, thanks for watching, and uh, I hope you guys check out some of my other videos. Um, please comment, like, and subscribe. Uh, hope to see you guys all again soon in another LEGO review video. Bye.